There are many correct methods to complete metric conversions. I'll show you one way that works for me. I start out by writing down the metric prefixes. Now I remember this through a rather silly mnemonic. King Henry died Monday drinking chocolate milk. Like I said, it's silly, but it works. The K stands for kilo, then hecto, and deca. Then we have the base unit, in this case meters, then smaller than a meter, deci, centi, and milli. Now I'll come over and look at the number to be converted. 3,821 meters, and I want to convert that into kilometers. I look at the units meters to kilometers. If I go from a small unit to a larger unit, the size of my number will decrease. If I go from a large unit to a smaller unit, the size of my number will increase. So, I want to convert from meters over to kilometers. I'll have to move the decimal point one, two, three places to the left. Coming back over here to my number, I'll move the decimal point one, two, three places to the left. So that tells me that 3,821 meters is equal to 3.821 kilometers. Let's look at problem number two. Once again, King Henry died Monday drinking chocolate milk. In this case, we're going to substitute grams for our base unit. Well, we won't be talking about meters, we'll be looking at grams. I need to convert from kilograms down to grams. From 0 0.002 kilograms into grams. In this case, I'm going from a large unit to a smaller unit. I'll expect the size of my number to increase. I'm going to move the decimal point from kilograms, one, two, three places, over to the grams. Taking the decimal point on my number, I'll move it one, two, three places to the right. So 0 0.002 kilograms is equal to two grams. Let's look at problem number three. Twelve kilometers into meters. Once again, King Henry died Monday drinking chocolate milk. Okay, from kilometers to meters. Now I'm starting out with 12, and I need to move the decimal point one, two, three places to the right. That's sort of interesting with this because I don't have anything over here. So I'll have to move the decimal point from here one, to three places to the right, which means I need to add zeros. So 12 kilometers is equal to 12,000 meters. Lastly, let's skip over to question number 17. I want to convert from centimeters to meters. From a smaller unit to a larger unit, I'm going to expect the size of my number to go the opposite direction or decrease if I go from a smaller to a larger unit. K H D M D C M. I'm going from centimeters to meters, one, two places to the left. Twelve, one, two. That means twelve centimeters is equal to 0.12 meters.